go to Max. Don't I'll hang you up. Say. How'd you like it if I dangled you yeah. behind out the window? Hey, you would. Wait, I warn you, I'm known for my fuzzy white butterfingers. It's true. You should see him trying to tie an ass guy. All right, all right. Have mercy. I've had mercy. It was unpleasantly gooey, like, well, like things that have fallen onto pavement from a great height. I give up. Take your phone and let me go. <coughs> oh, lover. I wish I could unsee that. Hello. Yes? Great gouts of steaming magma on a beeline for the orphanage. We're on our way. Yeah! Ow! Where's the rat? I let him go. Who was on the phone? It was the commissioner, Max. Multiple reports of malfeasance in the neighborhood. Oh, joy! That's my second favorite feasance. Idiot. We've got to get down to the corner store right away. I have a goldfish in our in our water cooler. <laughs> that I think that that rat's supposed to kind of replace that cat. No, not really. Like I well, kind of act the same a little bit. Yeah. Okay, basically, uh, this is what you're gonna. This is what you're gonna see like every uh, time you enter an episode. Um, you're gonna be able to go to Sybil's place, and then over here is Bosco's place, and then you can go and hit your uh, office. And then at certain points, you can get in your car and drive somewhere if you can drive anywhere. It, it, it depends on if they let you or not. Hmm. Ooh. So, where do you want me to go first? Uh, Bako's convenience, because we're going to have to go. Yeah, Bosco's my favorite character. He's pretty funny. Have no fear, simple citizens. The freelance police are here to keep the peace. Violently impossible, you call? It's just you two? Where's the SWAT team? Where's the National Guard? Where's NASA? NASA? Hold on, Bosco. What's the problem? What's the problem? It's a terrorist! A munchkin terrorist! He'll be the death of us all! Where is this Lilliputian agitator? Are you blind? He's right there! Yeah, sir, that is one ugly ki Hey, I know him! Oh, that's right. It's one of the lovable scamps from that 70s TV show about singing soda jerks. The soda poppers! Isn't he the one with the bladder control issues? Yeah, Wizard! He's a former child star. Oh, just lock him up and throw away to jail. What else? Is there? Throw away to jail? And throw him to jail. Oh. <laughs> Remain calm while he's doing... No, no, don't... Uh, what's that last one? I think we got it. Uh, what's he doing? Exactly what is the nature of Wizard's malfeasance? He's delivering videos I didn't even order. Brady Culture's eyeball, what is that? Oh, it's something bad, I can tell you that. Videos. And look at that display. It's subversive and hideous. I don't know any white guy with a fro like that. I hear that. <laughs> <laughs> what else is there? Remain calm. Video dumping, but why? Have you seen this Ibo video or any other complaints? Yeah. Have Have you seen that Ibo video? Have you actually witnessed this Ibo video with your own eyes? Only a fool would watch a strange video. You watch it. Alright, is there anything else? Video dumping, but why? Any other complaints? That, that's what I meant, like... I think yeah, we got yeah. it. But not like any other complaint thing. Any other heinous terrorist activities to report? Yes, he keeps using my bathroom. Who knows what he's doing in there? I think I know. So we've got an unwanted video dumper and serial leak taker. Not even the National Guard can help us now. <laughs> uh, you you click the right one now. Oh, okay. I don't. It's not really a. It's not really a white one. But 
Yeah, I One think of we us got needs it to take a couple dozen elephant tranquilizers and call it a day. And you should take a few yourself. How can I be calm with the Munchkin terrorist in my store? I think we got it. Okay. Anything else? We want to buy. Some. I think we got it. Anything else? <laughs> oh yeah, Bosco. The thing about Bosco is that he always has something you can buy from him, but you always gotta like pay him a bunch of money for it. Do you want to see what he has? Sure. We'd like to patronize your fine establishment, my good man. By patronize you, he means we want to buy stuff from you, not mock you. We probably will mock you, but that's not what he meant. I know what he meant. Don't patronize me. So what do you want to buy? What have you got? Well, I still got that big sale on cheese. Oh, yeah, cheese. I want that. And I might have another item of interest behind the counter. I accept your thinly veiled invitation to ask about the item behind the counter. Oh, it's just a little something I like to call a tear gas grenade launcher. Tear gas grenade launcher? Oh, yeah, I really want that. It's the latest in Bosco Tech innovation. It'll clear out a room of militant college students in no time. Guaranteed. I feel really close to you right now. <laughs> Get it. We'd like that tear gas grenade launcher. That'll be ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand bucks? We'll have to give out like a million tickets. Or one really big one. You mean white collar crime drive. Where corporate criminals go to rejoice in their ill gotten gains. After we blow this popsicle stand, we can go hunt us up one of those starchy cess piles and hit them where it hurts the most. Right in the pocketbook. That's not what I thought you were going to say, but that's good, too. We'll take that cheese that's just been sitting out in the open for everyone to touch. I can't scan it from way back here. You've got to bring it to the counter so I can ring it up. Do we have to do everything around here? Nothing for us right now. Okay. We'll chat more later, Bosco, but right now it's time to get up can you some personal... Can you actually get that grenade paperwork. launcher later? Yeah, you can get it later. You have to get money first, though. So. Free videos? Don't mind if I do. Brady Culture's Ibo for ocular fitness. The revolutionary isometric exercise. What's so revolutionary about it? See through walls and clothing. Roll your eyes at lightning speed. Lose five pounds of eyeball fat. Oh, good. I can never seem to lose that last five pounds. What do you say we start office movie night a little early today? I'll bring the caramel coated sugar logs. Okay. Try to talk to him. Yeah. Hey, what the heck? The crate that delivers bus. Hey there, Mr. Wizard. No need to be formal. My friends just call me Wizard. And so do my enemies, and lots of people like you I've never met. Everyone calls me Wizard. What exactly are you doing here? Delivering videos. Take one. They're free. Like, is there a question like why? Are you aware that you're breaking the law? Come on, guys. There's no law against giving away free stuff. Unlawful deliveries are punishable under Section 9, Article 7, Title 11 of the Personal, Private, Public, Professional Conduct Penal Code. You made that up true, but we could write him up for littering, trespassing, and disturbing the peace. I have to deliver these videos. Boy, what a monotonoid. Can we arrest him now? In a minute, little buddy. Ask why. What's Wait. the story with these videos? Brady Culture's eyeball is the ocular fitness regimen for people on the go. Who exactly is this Brady Culture fellow supposed to be? And what kind of steroids does he use on his hair? Brady Culture is a genius, and his Ibo program is a boon to all mankind. Ooh, a boon. Why don't people use that word more often? And did you know he was the star of Culture's Clubhouse in 1970? Fascinating. It's a child star bonanza. Oh, okay, then. Just, you're down here. Well, that's nice. What is? If you'll excuse us, we've got shopping to do. Take a copy of the Ibo video while you're at it. It will change your life. We got one, thanks. 